Alright, hello and welcome back. We have a event to play. It is the event made for uh, Bright Knight Exorcist for S. Durandal. And well, I think this time around uh, the Hellhound Labs and the uh, overall Godspan memory are made the way I pretty much like. And they, they, they did this time truly uh, try to make this pretty much really interesting. And I like that. And well, uh, we're about to play the whole the whole event story and we will see where it goes and we will see how the story will progress. A really so far uh, interesting aspect is how much as Durandal and how much this update has changed the game. We can for a we can ignore the login problems for a moment and we can actually talk about the good stuff that's been introduced into the version 3.9 and I think uh, adding cutscenes, adding 3D animated cutscenes is a way to go, I pretty much like that fact. And those physics are truly, truly there. <laughs> the physics on this character are are done really well. Okay, well, uh, forging Excelsis, this will be interesting. And let's, let's start. We have these couple stages, like a side story or a mini mini chapter, mini side story, and well, we're about to we're about to see how well it is actually made. Now I said I enjoyed it, so you can definitely be in for a really interesting interesting event. So uh, this pretty much is the well, it is pretty much the story how Toronto got her ass. Um, as battle suit, and it will be really interesting to find that out. Well, but but first, this is the first chapter, and this is Valkyrie Gloria, by the way, uh, the A rank one, or in the or in this case the <laughs> or in this case the triple S one. Okay, let me take them out really quickly. A quantum type, by the way, and as a quantum, she can take out everything with ease. Okay, that was sneaky. I didn't even start and I got and I got bombarded. <laughs> okay, fair enough. We almost got shred to pieces there. Thankfully, thankfully I evaded on time. Okay. And this is by the way, this is still Ark City, I think. It pretty much looks like Ark City. The whole scenery and the whole destroyed buildings definitely look like Ark City. But again, oh, well, we are at the base now. Hmm. Wait a second. Why does this base look like the base that we had that they have in that they have in Africa? Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Well, we have to mop the floor with these. With these enemies. That's one, that's two. This is three. There we go. The ultimate did a good job. That was a big hit. Alright, and we need to follow the marker, but first that let me catch that. Okay. And okay. Hmm, the train schedule. They said that they said the train the, the train was gone. Why is a train still here parked? <laughs> that kinda doesn't make sense. Anyway, uh, let's see. They transferred the package to their hideout. Follow them now. Okay, well, looks like we're on a pursuit. Uh, by the way, who did who did steal the package? That's interesting. They didn't mention a exact, a exact name. They just said they. The magic they. Okay, second stage. Second stage. Let's see. Well, if she found her, yep, looks like she did. How the hell did she find the enemy base in record time? That was kind of, isn't that kind of weird? But okay, I guess. Hmm, and this is one of the Dirac C maps. Interesting. With added boxes, I guess. Well, uh, let's see. Don't get spotted. Well, 
that's easier said than done. You know me, I am a expert at stealth, not a big problem, not a big problem at all. Let's see this one. How the hell did it survive? That, oh man. Well, looks like I'm not an expert on, on stealth, sadly. Though, how the hell did they survive? How the hell it did it survive? I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't, maybe I shouldn't attack it, maybe I just should have run past it, I don't know. Well, let's see where we should go. This one looks, this looks barricaded. Let me see if I can destroy it. Nope, I can't, okay. We have this passage over here. This is barricaded and, hmm. We have some of them down there. Well, let me pass, uh, let me run through them. We have a door over here, I think. Let's see. Oh, it's closed. Okay, well. Okay, I think I know what I have to do. Down there we have three of them. I have to kill two of them and then I need to kill this one over here. Yep, I, I can't kill him. Alright, well, I have to take out the ones that are running around him. Oh, I can actually kill it. Okay. But I can access the base. So I have to take these two out first. There we go, that's one, that's two, and now I can go over here and access the terminal, I guess. Hey, the door is the door is opened. Nice. Well let's let's walk to the door. And let's see what's beyond on the other side of it. Even though I already kinda know what to expect. Okay, keep going. Excellent. Well, so far it is going pretty, pretty smooth, isn't it? Alright, on to the next stage. We have, we are th I think we are already halfway through this. Almost halfway through this, through the, through the story. The third stage, what is this? Locks. Mirkheim. Oh, interesting. Well, near the end I'll, I'll give you time to read that, of course. And let's let's start the third stage and after that we will pretty much continue with the fourth, fifth and sixth. Okay, a a battle, nice. Okay, they're they're easy. And of course I am also in for the crystals, since I need those crystals. I am not satisfied with forty two thousand, almost forty three thousand, I need more. You, you know me, I always need more crystals. <laughs> always on the search for more crystals. Okay. Well, they are taken out, now we can continue moving on to the next area. Interestingly enough, this runs 60 frames per second for some reason. I don't know why Dirac C can't run 60 frames per second. Okay, well that's interesting little um, opening in the wall there. Definitely didn't expect to see that, but okay. And the ultimate wiped the floor with them, as expected. Alright. Let's see what will happen. Fourth generation, or in it, okay. Well, this is how we, how she got access to it. Alright, a cutscene. Nice. Something that I was expecting to see. Finally. Eh, short one. Okay. It fits. That's what she said. Okay. Well, that's literally what she said. Well, no evasion. Just attack. Okay. Let me take it out. Well, that was quick. Main tactical modules. Hmm. Yep. She looks like she is stripped. Excellent. Okay, I know this. Don't get spotted by the light. If you get spotted by the light, you will have to retry this. Uh, you have to take out these modules. And then after, uh, you have to take out these modules. And then after that, you pretty much have to be more careful. And there is the light. Oh my god. No, I got spotted. That, that was un unexpected. That was completely unexpected. Okay, well, um, I have to be more careful. Okay, we have to go here, now we have to pass 
over here and then we are over here now we have to wait for this light to pretty much oh no 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 no, no. we have to wait for this light to pretty much go away go away go to the other po go to the other side of the map there we go now now is the time to go here and pretty much yep that, that was quick and easy that was quick and easy and I didn't catch one evasion of course well unfortunately I didn't oh well doesn't matter I will I will miss that five crystals trial by fire is in there oh my god why do I have to why why is this forced tutorial I don't like a forest tutorial. Just let me play first. Look at this. Oh man, well, Forging Excelsis. Fourth stage. And let's start. Let's see where this goes. So far, uh, like I said, I like the way this is made. And it is pretty enjoyable. Uh, really interesting little side story and really interesting little extra story if you can call it extra story I think you can well take out all hostiles at the base okay shield module when you tap and hold the evasion oh yeah by the way um, something that I didn't talk about in the open in the beta something that I didn't talk about in the beta the shield module uh, the shield when you tap and hold the shield didn't work in the in the beta it was bugged and it was pretty much bugged till the end of the beta so that's why I didn't use it but you use it by tap tapping and holding the evasion and yeah that's pretty much how you use it in the in the beta that didn't work when you tap and hold the evasion nothing happened literally nothing happened it was bugged but now it is fixed, thankfully, in the in the official release, and now you can pretty much use it all, all you are, all you like. Okay, there is more of them. Nice. <sighs> Tap and hold the block. <laughs> the shield, interesting. And the final, the final mobs of the of the round, these two fellas. But I still like the evasion. When you evade, it's still a lot more effective. But well, anyway, you can use her. You can use her all uh, any way you like, pretty much. Well, I think we cleared the stage. Uh, two more left, or one more left. We are about to find out. Okay, on to the next one. Uh, really, a really fun to play character. I, I don't know why people really hate this character. I pretty much enjoy playing her. Uh, yes, I know that she is in top tier. I know that fact. I know that she needs her gear. That's something that I dislike about her, honestly, the gear. But overall, the playstyle and the overall way she's playing and the mechanics are pretty fun and pretty unique so far in this game. All right, well, uh, interesting new map. Nice. I haven't have actually haven't seen this map in a while. Haven't seen this map in a while. Maybe last time seen in. Chapter 7? <laughs> Two years ago. Okay, that's a long time. Okay, let's let's do the evasion. Let's do the damage. Nice. So that was 66,000 damage. Interesting. Okay. One thing that I forgot to use is the charge attack, but it, it doesn't matter since it's not anything challenging. It is just a story, so I forgot to use the charge attack, my god. Usually I, I, I used to spam that when when I played the beta. Okay, nice, and time to go up. Yeah, time to go up. Okay. Time to walk up. And let's see what we'll... What we'll oh, we found the sword. Okay. It was hidden over here, interesting. Interesting. Well, on to the next one. Well, we have two of them, actually. Interesting. One of them is downstairs. <laughs> okay. And it is the shield, probably. I forgot. That will unlock the ultimate, I think. Yeah, it, it is the shield. Okay. There it is. The shield. Interesting. Well, let's unlock it. And let's take it. 
battle battle suit has full power okay well let me let me unleash that full power I'm really interested to see how it works even though I know how it works oh I see what they did they gave you they gave you infinite uh, infinite throws they gave you infinite ultimate okay well it's it's okay and there we go dumpstered there we go, 172,000 damage, what the hell, that's a lot of damage, and final one, one shot, one kill, there we go, well her hair is on fire for, for some weird reason, but besides that, that was pretty smooth, that was really smooth, alright, well, uh, this was, yeah, I, I took all crystal rewards, nice. Well, this was 5 out of 6, and the last one is left to be played. Let's do it. I am pretty pretty interested in seeing how this will end. And, of course, in the end, uh, I will leave you uh, some time to screenshot or to pause the video and to pretty much read the description of, uh, of, this, of this Valkyrie. Since I usually... I usually read that when I edit, uh, not to take too much of the video's time. Okay, well, the final one, Heimdall, okay. Close range blocks can weaken enemy shields, well, thank you, uh, I, I already knew that, though. Okay, that was bad evasion. And I couldn't move for a moment, I don't know what happened. Eight, seven, nice. Well, I'll just, I'll just attack from back. Another evasion, <coughs> good, great. Can I use the stab attack? Oh, no, I can't. Well, I can actually. All right, good. And through the evasion, thank you for the five crystals. <laughs> I needed them. There is the charge attack. I finally remembered to use it. Okay, evasion and ultimate is, is unleashed. Now this boss will be dead really quickly. Four bars left, so let's see. Three bars left, okay. Two bars left, nice. One bar left, very nice. And the boss is dead. GG, that was pretty fun. Once the ultimate pops on with this character, it is just all over. <laughs> <laughs> Once the ultimate pops up, it is just all over. Well, we have destroyed the base somehow uh, by taking out the the mobs. Well, anyway, well, anyway, uh, that was a fun little fun little event. Definitely enjoyable and one of the events that I personally liked. Well, uh, that was it for the for the forging excelsis. And, well, looks like we have one more final cutscene here, interesting. And after that, uh, I will just pop up the window where you can read the... Um, where you can read the description of the character. Of course, you will have to pause the video because I will read that after in the... When I edit, that's what I usually do. And, well, um, what the hell is going on here? Are we transferring? The, yeah, we are. We are teleporting the battle suit somewhere. Interesting. Very interesting. I, I think we actually saw the battle suit in chapter seven when you go uh, when we when we were in the secret labs. I remember we uh, in the battle suit laboratory. We did see it. it was really interesting. Well, uh, let's take a look at the logs, shall we? So, uh, you can take your time, you can pause the video and read it, you can do that for all of the all of the logs that I'll show you here, and, well, um, next time when I return, we are going to be probably continuing with the hard and supreme stages, it depends, uh, I still have to see what the update has to offer, and I still have to see when the new update, when the new story will be available, maybe we will play the new story, we will see, depends, and well, 
With that being said, I really hope that you enjoyed. It was my pleasure to play this for you. And well, with that being said, I will see you next time. Take care.